racism in sport? What is it? Thanks, Shane. What is racism in sport, you may ask? A very complex issue in the world of today. However, first we must discuss what is racism. Well, we know the term race can be described as a group population of human beings being characterised by their physical traits. Therefore, racism is being discriminated against these groups based on their ethnical beliefs, values and appearance. That's well and good, but how does it answer racism in sport? Whether it's the odd put down or stereotype, we can gather that racism in sport is indeed the discrimination of these diverse cultures, individuals or populations that we see in teams on the field rep being represented by their franchise, club or even just their nationality. Here is a prime example of where racism occurs in soccer. We gonna shut him down. Y'all thought we killed him with the last one. Remix. DB. Diaz brothers. Slow rider. Hold on. Pitbull. Look at that. Racism happens every day and everywhere. It is a complex issue which occurs at many different levels. In sports, racism is happening more often and it's becoming a bigger issue. In sports such as the AFL, football, rugby and tennis, sport associations are trying to conquer this growing concern and are implementing rules which will diminish the occurrence of racism down both on and off the field. Sport and race have a complex, self-perpetrating, symbolic role in constructing social body found that from the 14 clubs surveyed by the EPL, 20.3% of players were, found, were black or black British, 4.1% were mixed race, 0.4% were Asian, 0.7% were Chinese or other, leading to greater chances of these racial slurs. During the 2010-2011 season, there were 43 arrests for the racist chanting of the football matches just in England and Wales alone, which is the highest to, to the highest since 2005 to 2006, and the research finds that it is only escalating since. Now here's what some people have to think. I think racism is a concern throughout society, but uh, sport is definitely helping people get to know races differently, and it's definitely less of a concern now than it was a few years ago. Um, I think racism in sport is starting to become under control. Earlier it was pretty out of hand, but now because of the awareness and everything that's come of the earlier stuff, it's starting to get more under control. and. There's a lot less racism in sport now. Yeah, not for I think racism in sport is a growing concern because I think racism is a problem anywhere, especially in sport where they have so much um, influence over the public. Thanks, Ashley. What can we do about it, you say? Well, there's a few approaches that can be taken. It's an issue that is clearly underestimated due to the increase in racism in sports through media exposure or racist remarks. People should just deny the fact that there are different races in sport. Thus, the amount of remarks in the sports field and the fact, and also we have to deny the fact that race classifies a person. In fact, about 10% of the population use race to classify other people. I also believe advertisements and campaigns to promote equality amongst the human race should be emphasised further to encourage and avoiding the categorisation of a person based on their ethnicity or colour. Now, here's Shane to recap everything. Hey, Samuel. In conclusion, we see that racism is a very complex issue in sport. It can be defined as discrimination against a particular race. Although it's a large issue, there are several campaigns to eliminate racism from sport, such as racial equality in football in the EPL, resulting in 43 arrests. Overall, as a group, we believe that racism is a growing concern, but the right actions are being taken to rid racism from sport.